DNA, Subtle Purples. An interesting comment caught my attention the other day. It made me think, hmm. Why? Oh. What, what if? if? Can't automate the master bus, let's make our own master bus. Hey, what the fuck? I'm probably not the first one to come up with this, but if you don't know of this, which apparently some people don't, then uh, check this out. If you love my content more than life itself, please hit the subscribe button, subscribe to me, consider supporting me on Patreon, and check out my website. Blazerbeats.com This workaround is actually easy peasy, lemon squeezy. What we're gonna do essentially is make our own fake master bus. We're gonna make a group, then we're gonna send all of our other groups into the master group. And then we're gonna be able to automate that and do whatever we want to it. So let's, let me find an empty group right here. C, all right, I see, let's name it master so we can keep track of things especially if you got a lot of groups going on it's a good thing to keep track and name of your i, I suck at that so i'm not gonna i'm not gonna be the preacher on that but i try to tell myself stay organized so okay let's try rooting one of the groups here to our master group first we need to go to channel and then to output and this is where we root our audio right now it goes straight to the master oh what is this? There is no group C2 master here. That's because for some reason you can't root audio to another group unless there is something in it. So we're going to put an effect on it. And uh, rather I choose something neutral that doesn't affect the sound, but you can actually have a whole chain of effects there. So let's go to plug in, hold shift, press browse and put a EQ there. Now let's try again. Channel. Ah, there it is, our fake master in the computer ordinator system device. Now you can do this from the controller one by one. Or you can select multiple of them like this. Ah, there, master. Now they should be all on C2. And you can do it from the computer by holding Alt and Shift. That's on Mac. I'm guessing it's the same on PC. I can't remember. And this is the page where you should be at. On output, group, output, select the master. Don't root the master group itself to itself. No, you can't even do that. So don't worry about that. One thing you can try to see if it works is to mute the channel, the master group, because then you're gonna, since all of the groups are rooted through the master group, when you muted the master group, everything should be mute. So that way you can also make sure that you have all, all of the groups rooted to that one. Yes, it's muted. No, it's not. Now it's muted. No, it's not. Perfect. Seems like it's working. Now, if we want to automate some stuff in here, we got to make sure we have patterns. So these will essentially be like uh, fake automation tracks, but they work just as fine. Remember to make unique patterns if you're going to have different automations during different phases of your beat. Common noob mistake. Now, hey, uh, the possibilities are pretty much endless. We can add uh, perform effects to there. Let's uh, have a nice stutter that we can automate. We can add like, uh, I don't know, a filter to it. Normally I wouldn't add a filter because the low pass filter, for instance, even though you have the cutoff set to the maximum, you're still cutting off a lot of high end, but we'll do it just for fun. And now even more cool thing you could do is assign some macros to it. Holding shift, pressing macro, giving a parameter, just a slight little rub. Now when we go to our macros, we have the, the, the cutoff there. Nice. Let's put some other length on the stutter effect and some metaverb. It's one of my favorites. So this one we could 
yeah let's just go with the mix any parameter you could do this to now we can go to the macros and record our art our, our automation remember when you record the automation to activate the automation you can have it toggled by holding shift and pressing it and then you're ready to rocket ship what more can i say jesus goddamn holy mother is shit this is amazing you can imagine the possibilities with this let's try it Not exactly the best performance, but you can see the infinite possibilities with this. Boom! Wasn't so hard at, was it? If you're still a noob with the machine, highly recommend the Machine Noobs Mastery course on the Blessed Beats Academy. <laughs> Link in the description below. Also, if you like this beat right here, or if you want some fire ass drums, you can check out my website too. Okay, bye bye. <laughs>